that stuff put away. Okay. This Mr. Guppy we're taking out is a very important man. Everything's got to be just right. Oh, it will, Mo. He'll be happy he rented our boat for the day. Well, he better be, because he's got a terrible temper. Now, go put that stuff below. Hey! Hey! Oh! Go check the bait! Aye, aye, aye. check the bait. Check the bait. Hold still, fellas. Hold still. Look out. Come here. I gotta check you guys. Check. 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 Open. Mm -hmm. Just a minute. Yeah. Get back in there, Willie. What do you happen to be doing? What you told me, checking the bait. Oh, you're checking the bait? Yeah. Well, with this brush? Yeah. I'll check you, you thimble brain. There, you're checked. Now go wash your face. Tell them about the cartoon. Speak up, they can't understand you. But what he's saying is, but you better watch the cartoon, because it's an awfully cute one. Captain Lai, how long till we get to the treasure? <laughs> Ow! You two heads! Have that's the mizzen mask! No more of that mizzen mast stuff. We want treasure. Yeah, jewels and pieces of seven. Seven? What do you mean, seven? Pieces of eight, eight, eight. Ah, I don't want to be greedy. <laughs> no more chatter, you landlubbers. Clean up the jib boom. You mean this? That's so good. Are you sure he said free knock? Oh, this means we can't sail, right? It means you're sick, Larry. Look, your chowder head's a bottle. Oh, hey, you scurvy seagulls. Now read this. Hmm, a message. It's from the captain. All right, you mastheads, walk the plank. Yours truly, Captain Lie. Walk the plank? What plank? I don't see no plank. Here, plank, plank. Here, plank, plank, plank. <laughs> I think we got the captain's goat. Hey, look, the treasure. My gosh, how are we going to lift it? With this rope, you fish head. Look, it's even got suction cups. I get it. Aha! He must be the guardian of the secret treasure. All right, Chubby. It's tough work, but steady. No, no, that's my treasure. Mine, mine. Uh, is Bubbles here a friend of yours? He's our captain. Now, give me my treasure. Are you getting me hooked? Don't just stand there, sawdust heads. Grab the treasure. That's it, men will lose further. And we'll be rich and famous. Hey, Mo. There's no such thing as electric eels, is there? You silly goon. Of course not. What a relief. Yeah! Look, the treasure chest. It's open. At last, gold doubloons and pieces of eight. We won our daddy. Where's our daddy? That's the treasure? What's the matter? You don't like baby octopuses? Daddy, daddy, we love you, daddy. Daddy, you so great, daddy. Shuck. Ain't nothing no other green-blooded American octopus wouldn't do. <laughs> Here comes Mr. Guppy. Thanks, I could have drowned. Yeah, 
Sonny Joe, come on. Well, well, welcome aboard, Mr. Guppy. All set for you, sir. Right. Yep, there's your chair, sir. Yep, Mr. Guppy's rod. Mr. Joe Guppy's rod, coming up. Right there. And a boy, there yes, you are, sir. sir. Yep, sir. Now, cast off to get underway. I'll take the wheel. I, I, sir. Right. Watch that car drag. Whoop, speed ahead! We got this job making pies for Mr. Hassenpfeffer. He said if the customers at his place like him, he'll give us a deal for more pie. Oh. Hey, Frizzletop. You like pie? I love it. Yeah, then let me give you one. Look out! Larry? Yes? I'll teach you to ruin our pies. How do you like that? Ruin pies? Well, you didn't do that one any good, buddy boy. Why don't you shut up and mind your own business? Oh, yeah? Ooh. Well, <laughs> that's the right. way we're playing. That's what you keep talking. What's that for? That's my friend! Yeah, I'm his friend, and you can ask for the friend. Hold out your hand. Oh, I love it. Oh, I like that. That's very nice. Oh. You think this is a mess? Well, one time we... Well, you should have seen when... It, well, I remember... Well, anyway, you keep watching. You'll see. Tinhead, always thinking of your stomach. Boy, if this message fell into Count Dunkula's hands, we'd really be in trouble. Take a good look at him, men. He's sneaky. And tricky. And clever. He can change himself into a bat, just like that. Hey, that has a poetic ring to it. So does this. Speaking of bats, look out. It's Dunkula. Ouch! He got me on the ear! Delete. Somebody get some salt. We'll put it on his tail. You're sick, Larry. Hey! He got our top secret message! Grab him! Now to get back to General Von Long. Hold it, men. This calls for strategy. See? Dawn's breaking. So? And so? So what's a bat got to do? Roost, right? Right. right. So all we gotta do is find the right tree. All right, Dunkula, you're caught. Like a rat in a trap. You mean a bat in a trap? Yeah, hands down. Are you ready for this? Grab him! <laughs> Whoop, you idiot. I got the message. You have been holding by an expert. Boy, what a loud mouth. Hang on, Curly. I can't hold on, I'm falling. <laughs> Saved by the balloon. Quick, Curly, catch. Got a match? Hurry up, lame brain. I am, I am. <laughs> oh! Help! Help! Wait for me! Who oh, would be barbecuing at this altitude? Well, uh, but I still have the top secret message. Yeah. Thanks, fellas. <laughs> the general staff shall be plenty for this top secret message. Oh, no, you don't. As a drop! It 
comes that big shot again. I get it. Well, that's the end of old Dunkula. All noises. Goodbye. Thank you. Okay, stick him up. I'm sure. Must we have a chance to change into a bath? Off and away! Well, he got away again. That's obvious, you squirrely brain. But we've got the top secret message. What does it say? It says the war's over. Congratulations. Signed, General Newsom. <laughs> All the pies ruined. No, they're all... Hey, wait a minute. No, here's one that's in good shape. Well, give me that, stupid. You're too close. No, 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 no. Oh, come no, on. No, give no, it to me. No, no, no. Who's my shoe? Don't stop. Idiot. What are you doing? Oh. Mr. Hassenbeck. Very good. Make me a hundred. I like them. Come on, come on. What's with the service around here? More lemonade on the double. Coming up, coming up. Get a move oh, on. Yeah, all right. Well, it's so cool. Fellas, I'm sorry, but it takes me to really serve me first, you know. I'm sorry, Mo, but he is plastic. That's all. Ah, too sour. I'm sorry, Mo. I didn't mean it. Answer the door, stupid. Oh, good. Uh, the door. Come back, 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 Hey, who could be sending me a telegram? Hey, give me that. It's not for you. Well, oh, here now. Just take it easy and speak when you're spoken to. Well, what do you know? It's for Curly Joe. Yeah, yeah. Shut up a minute. This is to inform you that by the terms of your Uncle Dudley's will, you will inherit his entire estate in the neighborhood of one million dollars. Wow, what a neighborhood. Wait, we're rich, we're rich. Take off that apron. Yeah. Don't tie yourself, girl. Sit down. Huh? Sit down. What? Here, would uh, you like some cake? Well, well not what, by the way. Have some, uh, Let me squeeze some grapes. No, 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 no. Faster, boy. Not too fast. I'll get a chill. Too sour? No, it's too cold. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, boy. Yes? Turn on the TV set. Yes, master. I want to see what sort of mess those three fellows get into today. They're quite stupid, you know. I agree. make any money taking dents out of pots. How about if we put dents into pots? Thou art sick, Larry. Harkin. Ow! A steed approached. Oh, you bleeding steed wolf. Oh, oh, I say it. Get dukes, fellas, look. Tis a royal knight of the king's round table. Yeah. Verily. Yeah. <laughs> I am called Get Out of Ye Old Town by Ye Old Sundown Brown. No! You better believe it, mate. He thinks I have need for a new suit of dousting armor. Build me one. Gladly, thoroughly. Before sundown. Impossible. What? What? It's impossible. It's possible. It's impossible. Ready, Curly? Yeah, be ye vassal sure this is going to work now. Fear not, Sir Knight. When Curly cuts you loose, you will fly into this sheet of heavy, thick, hard steel. Sounds reasonable. Whereupon, yon sheet of steel will wrap around ye noble body from the force of ye bone-crushing impact. And presto, instant armor. Well, what do we think of next? Lay on, Violets. Five, four, three, two, one, shot! Let's try that again, Curly. 
Let's get on with it, Mays. Ready, Carly? Three, two, one, chop! <laughs> get Sooks, that was way too high. Oh, well. Better luck next time. And that thing threw Jan's car as you were fixed my head. Courage, brave knight. New inventions always have a few bugs to be ironed out. This time, we'll aim lower. Ready, Carly? Chop! Well, that was better. The next shot should be perfect. I'll allow for the wind. All right, Jeff Harris. Let's quit these fooling around. Chop away, Carly. Right home! Good, Ted. It really works. Alligators can hardly tend our armor. Uh-oh. He's mad. Let's get out of here. Hey, what went wrong, fellas? Charge! 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 Oh, boy, he's got a job to do. Some people don't appreciate progress. It's a conspiracy against automation. Charge! Charge! Stupid. Hey, stupid. Answer the phone. Just a minute. He means me. Pardon me, stupid. Curly Jones residence. Yes, yes, we got the telegram. Sure. The wrong what? For Curly John? Yeah, I understand. Goodbye. Well, what do you know about that? What? No inheritance. No means of? No nothing! What are you going to say about that? Well, I was wondering why my Uncle Dudley left me all that money. Yes? Because, fellas, I never had an Uncle Dudley. That's what I get up out of here. Get that off. Get that off. Come on, it's blurred in my mind.